Alright, so for today's shave, I'm still going to prep, get ready and everything. Um, just finished taking a shower. I'm going to be using this Camisari presentation box that it came in. Don't know if it's the original one for the razor, but uh, the guy supplied it all the way from Japan. so it doesn't slide around. There's the razor. Look at that bevel shine there down at the bottom. Uh, this is the one I've been honing. For those that can ooh, see that script, best way on this to show it. I don't know if it reads this direction. Or if it reads this direction. To my limited knowledge I would say it probably reads like that. That's how it looks from that side. You can see it catching on the light. Handles probably leather or bamboo. I like how it fits. And I've added that to the background. I think that comes in pretty cool there. Uh, that'll stay in the background even for any other reason, but there we go. All right, I'm gonna prepare. Uh, I'll be using Prairie Creations, uh, the Faux Williams. This is the lemon one. Mm, the Walters. Uh, some Moog brush, which has been soaking my whole shower. Look at that. A little loft, huh? Hopefully it'll hold plenty of soap. There's the old spice. Shulton mug. Found this one. On eBay, I believe, is where I got mine. Found one similar to it at an antique shop just up the street from my son. So he has, I don't think he has a shit French, I can't remember which one his is, but as far as being Old Spice mugs, we both have matching mugs. Not that he's shaving it, but just something for a father and son to share on. It's pretty cool. All right, I'll be right back. Get ready. As you can see, got lather all around the whiskers. It's probably about seven days growth. Razor. And now let's see. I also have my contacts in again today. I'm going to try to give this much respect because um, it is very sharp. And uh, I went over about another 30 laps, just full back and forth on the um, green paste and chromium oxide. And went about 50 on the felt, went back to chromium, did another 30, went back to felt, synthetic felt that I have, and did 50. And then I went to the dressed leather and did about uh, 60, 60 to 70, somewhere in there. And so that was all I did to prepare it for today.
but it was already ready to go before that, but oh, should be good. I've been practicing by holding a seamstress ruler, which we used to use for gig lines in the military. It's just like a ruler that's probably about that same width and about that long and has like a little slider on it which you can go 30 seconds and 60 fourths and has the other markers too but a seamstress ruler is like really thin so kind of similar as far as what it looked like dog barking. That is the puppy upset. In her cage. Okay.
That was interesting. Definitely cut their own though. What I just did is not traditional. I took the side with the stamp and used that to go under there. Seems to work better for me, uh, especially with facial hair, meaning this. Okay, went light on the soap this time, but just to be wet and slick, and we'll see how this goes. It's not traditional.
Alright, so that's pretty... Okay. Trying to get used to using this type of razor. Um, I think I would definitely enjoy it more if uh, it was designed... I guess you could use it for me the way as I had been. But the feel of each side when you go against the face is different. So if you were to go with the stamp against your face, um, and just know that it is a slightly different attack than with the wedge side against the face. Um, normally I don't go for BB shaves anyway. Just because they, I don't know, my hair doesn't grow fast enough, so if I did a BBS shave all the time, I wouldn't get the joy of shaving more often. Even though most of the time, lately I've been waiting to shave just to kind of display what the razor's capable of removing growth-wise. This one, again, really sharp, very happy, uh, eBay purchase from Japan, and... Uh, in the future, after I get more comfortable with this one, I'll consider another. I've seen Camisaris which seem to look a lot larger than this in people's hands. And this one seems to have the perfect size if you're going to be using it. Uh, on a shave that, on a face that has a little bit more angular areas, especially Adam's apple and all this windpipe nonsense here that goes makes it very tough with a wider razor. Um, so that's my take on it. It's a keeper. better. Uh, I'm going to touch up with something mild. we got a progress waiting for me set on one. So that's what I'm going to finish with long handle progress. Uh, but that's it for this camisori shaving video. Thank you. Bye.